All right, YouTube, Freedom for Kaz here. How's it going out there? I know it's my third video today, but, you know, there's a lot of stuff going on right now, and there's a lot of stuff about the Cedar Falls incident. You know, if you haven't heard by now, which I'm sure you heard, you know, Cedar Falls has passed an ordinance to where everybody who lives in an apartment complex or some type of um, community residence or if you own a business, you have to have a access key somewhere there on the premises in a lockbox. So if your house catches on fire, your business catches on fire, that the the fire department or the police station or the rescue squad or whomever can unlock your door and enter your premises. Okay. But the bigger, the bigger discussion about this is right on this link right here I mean it's right here it, it's right here plain and simple it smacks you right in the face and this is what happens when people are sleeping this is what happens when people are watching Dancing with the Stars American Idol The Voice watching their favorite sports teams or whatever it's in the first two sentences that's where all of this came from. It's in the first two sentences, and they did it while the sheep were out grazing in the yard. Listen. This is how stupid it is. Listen. Cedar Falls, Iowa. What a difference a few years makes and an online revolution makes. Seven years ago, Cedar Falls City Council passed an ordinance requiring lockboxes on commercial buildings and larger apartment complexes. Hardly a soul made a peep about it. They're telling you. Right there. That's all you need to know. Right there. It says seven years ago. Where were you guys seven years ago? It said no one made a peep. You know why? Because this is what happened. It's not my apartment. It's not my business. You know, they want to put it on some larger comp corporations. That's fine. I just own a small landscaping business. I just own a small restaurant. I just own a small this or that. Well, my apartment complex is only only has four units in it. You know, they're, they're going after the units that have 20 or 30. It says right there, hardly a soul made a peep. Why? Because it didn't happen to them. Now that it's happening to them, seven years later, oh, wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. Where were you seven years ago? This is where you were. Oh my God, I got, I got, I got, I got to vote for my favorite dancer. Oh my God, oh, oh, it's American Idol. I got to call in. I got to text an answer. Oh my God. That's where you were. That's exactly where you were. Dancing with the Stars, American Idol. Seven years ago they did this to you and only a few people said anything. Cedar Falls, Iowa, you better wake up. And the rest of America better wake up because this is going to spread across the United States. And you know, they're saying, they're telling you it's for your safety. It's for your safety so we don't have to bust down your door. You know what it's for? So they can go in there anytime they want and take your gold, your silver, your guns, your ammo, your food. Do you seriously think if they go into your house and you call back and say, hey, the police were here and I've got 10 things missing, do you seriously think that they're going to do anything about it? You call back and say, well, my 44 caliber is missing and my two 12-gauge shotguns are missing. What, do you think they're going to file a police report? Well, we had to go into your house because we saw a burglar run into the apartment complex and we checked 10 units and one of them was yours. Well, maybe the burglar took the stuff. We don't really know. We're sorry. Sorry. That's what you get. Sorry. And you should point, look at the mirror, and point the finger at yourself. Because nobody stood up when it first happened. 
nobody. And now here it is, seven years later, they want to do everybody's house, everybody's business. Now it's, wait a minute. We talk about this exact stuff all the time. Open your eyes. Listen. Say something. Say something. Do something. Your government is walking all over you. You know what's going to be next? I'll tell you what's going to be next. They're going to outlaw putting locks on doors because it's, it's, it takes that five seconds to do the combination and grab the key and then open the door. That five seconds might save somebody's lives. Now, well, you can't have locks on anything. You can't lock your house. You can't lock your business. You can't lock your closet. You can't lock your garage. Everything's got to be unlocked. So we can come in whenever we want, take whatever we want, and leave whenever we want, and you don't have a voice to say anything. We talk about this all the time. And what do you people do? Oh, I gotta, I gotta call Dancing with the Stars. I gotta call American Idol. I gotta vote. Oh my God, I gotta vote. Uh, my, my, my dancer lost. Who cares about your damn dancer? Who cares about your damn singer? Look, America. Look at what's going on. Go home. Look in the mirror. And say, I screwed up. 